was that hair, cat hair all over? Sorry, I've been cuddling my cat. Mm -hmm. Little Nemo. Oh, my cat is literally right here. He wants cuddles, but our move date is quickly approaching and we have done almost nothing, pretty much nothing. I'm trying not to stress. I'm really, really trying super hard not to stress about it, but the stress is kicking in. So because our move is quickly approaching and I really need to get some stuff done, I thought I'm going to start today. I've already gone through my books and most of my clothes and separated the things I want to donate from the things I want to keep. So I think I'm going to just start throwing things in boxes. I have a lot of things and I am ready to part ways with a lot of things so I think it's just time to start doing it. I think I'm going to start in my bedroom because that right now is the least overwhelming and then we'll just go from there. Nothing at all to see here. Nothing at all. It's just a little lump. <laughs> what are you doing in there? You silly. You silly boy. You just want to sleep in the bed like that? You cozy? You look really cozy. He's so cute, it's not even funny. Oh, he's camera shy. You want to go in? Okay. I can't even. Gosh, he's so adorable. Ah. Oh. All right, so I think the best thing to do is just throw things in boxes. Yeah. I don't want to overthink this, so. I will just do this box. Oh, this really sucks. I wanted to do more. That's fine. This drawer is definitely a little bit overwhelming because this is my I just put everything in here drawer. I have like, oh my gosh. See, these are things I can't get rid of. I feel like I want to get some kind of binder or maybe even a scrapbook, but this is one of my wallflower call sheets. Obviously very sentimental and these are my wallflower scripts. So like Can't get rid of these. I definitely need some kind of binder or Some way to remember them. Why is this is a microphone that I use for auditions like ah, There's so much in here. I don't even use this phone anymore. There's, the phone isn't even in here It's literally just the box with like the instructions and stuff which I <laughs> It's so silly. Garbage. <gasps> Garbage bag. Okay, again, how do I get rid of this? This is my TIFF volunteer badge from 2022. Empty glasses case. Empty, oh, uh, for my microphone. I also have so many wires. I just can't get rid of them. 
wire, 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 battery charger, wire, <laughs> literal trash, candle that is empty, so again, trash. I don't even know what this goes on top of. Trash. Why am I like this? I'm guessing this is from a bathing suit, but like, which one? Twist tie? Combination to a lock that I no longer have. Old receipt, like, why am I like this? Sock. Why is there a sock in there? Another one of these. Please tell me I'm not the only one who's like this, who like, just, can't throw seemingly garbage away. Oh my gosh, this phone. This was literally like my favorite cell phone. Matt bought it for me for I think my birthday, which like, which was really sweet. I love this phone so much. I mean, the back is beautiful, but the screen broke. Cell phones are hard for me to throw away even when they're broken just because the pictures and like the stuff, the memories that are on the phones, I just, Tech in general is really hard for me to throw away. When you have like memories on here, I'm just, I'm scared to get rid of them. So something I need to work on. So I emptied that out. The bookshelf is pretty much empty. It's just things in there that I like in my nightstand that I'm not gonna be getting rid of. There's more stuff that I wanted to do, but because I don't have tape, I'm really upset. I wanted to get this stuff done. Actually, do I have more? You know what, I think I'm just gonna run to the dollar store real quick. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Whew. It is hotter out there than I was anticipating, but I was able to get the tape. And we're back. We are making a good dent today. Today, the main focus is to pack as much as possible. There's a lot that needs to be done. We are getting a little bit stressed out just because there's some communication issues happening right now and we're not fully sure what day exactly we are moving. So we're hoping that that gets fixed soon. But today we are going to make a huge dent. I just, I just know it. Plus it's not gonna be me packing alone today. It's going to be Matt as well. So I think by the end of today, it's not going to look as chaotic as it does right now. So let's do it.
Did you find a hiding spot? Uh oh. Nemo's coming. <laughs> Cute. It's a little bit later and we have made some good progress. Some of the boxes here. We ordered some food. Don't mind the mess. It's going to be chaos until it's not. We are done for today. I think I'm going to tackle the bathroom tomorrow. Still lots to do, but we made a good dent. Our credibility with Five Eyes allies has been put at risk. There are better ways of uh, trying to bring quite a This house stands adjourned until Monday, September 18th. That's how it sounded just after midnight last night as the house- How we set unrealistic expectations can take a while. That doesn't mean what we- And we're back. We made some really good progress yesterday. It's crazy to see the apartment in this state and I am excited to get to the new place. There's gonna be sounds, there's construction going on, so there's gonna be sounds, but it's kind of sad, I, I'm not gonna lie. I am kind of sad to be leaving this place, I mean. I think it's because it's a move that like we didn't plan and we've really loved living here. We've made some really good memories in this apartment. I mean, little Nemo, this is the only apartment he's ever known, huh? We got you in this apartment, right? This has been his only home. <laughs> so sweet. I'm definitely excited for the apartment to not be a mess. <laughs> it's overwhelming, but I'll show you what we did. So yesterday, there's some boxes there. These boxes that aren't closed because there's still room to put stuff in there. There's also some boxes in the closet just so we could have more room. But this is the craziest part. This is just stuff that donation stuff it's exploding i know but look at here all of matt's movies gone i mean they're not gone they're packed away but it's crazy to see his shelves like that he has a very big movie collection so to see them just packed away it's crazy so today the plan is to do the bathroom so pretty much anything that i'm not going to need or that matt is not going to need i'm just gonna put it in boxes because i want to get it done a little bit stressed out right now because we still don't know what day we're moving just waiting to hear back from people because we're having issues with communication and it's been really stressing me out but you know we're also having kind of like the scary i mean scary for me i'm finding it very scary but because our building is under construction people seem to just assume that there's nobody living in our apartment and they keep on just walking in just walking in to our apartment and it's actually terrifying and like we lock the door like these people are unlocking our door and just walking in we're having issues with that so another reason why i'm very excited to be out of here because it's happened a couple times where i've been sleeping in the morning and there's just a stranger that tries to walk into my apartment it's terrifying yeah there's a lot of things I know I don't need in here, but like, there's always that little bit of anxiety that I'm going to pack something I do need. So I think I'm going to just throw everything in boxes and not close them just to be safe.
the cats were being too good and too quiet. This is my fault. I should have put a lid on food, but I went out there to go grab something and both the cats were huddled over a piece of chicken. They stole chicken off my plate from my lunch and they were eating it. four boxes empty empty not fully empty but this is the stuff that I still use there's me it is the last day in this apartment and it's mayhem <laughs> it's chaos there's still what feels like a lot to do I'm not gonna lie, lots of running around to do. Wednesday, we did a lot of running around. We donated everything that needed to be donated except for one bag that I promised I would donate to my work. I need to bring Matt's computer to the new apartment because we actually have our Wi-Fi being hooked up today, so we don't have internet at this apartment right now. I have to, as you can see, there's still lots that needs to be packed, but these were all things that like we use every day, so we're also getting the keys today, which I'm so excited. When I say I'm excited to move, I'm actually so excited to move. I mean, all things all things considering right like here let me let me sit down to have gone from like not planning on moving at all to now being super excited and like i can't wait to move so that's nice oh my gosh it looks worse than it actually is <laughs> We're here. It's very echoey in here, obviously. It's completely empty, so we got this cute little goodie bag. I'd show you the front, but it has the name of the building on it, and I'm not about to do that, but this is the space. Oh my gosh, I can't even. I definitely feel at home, so okay. I'm home. Oh my gosh. I want to cry. I'm so happy right now. There's a huge park. I didn't even realize how big this park was here too. I can walk to a park. Ugh. Oh my gosh. It already feels like home. I know I need to go back to my other apartment and finish packing, but place just it's crazy how how much this place already feels like home and how grateful I feel to be here I know that the space just has so many new possibilities I'm really happy here I feel like this is exactly where I'm supposed to be and I almost don't want to go back to the other apartment and yes i know i need to finish packing and get that chapter completely closed out but i just i almost feel like i don't want to go back i just feel so just feel so right to 
to be here. So, okay, I have to get back <laughs> so I can finish packing, so. We're back here. Sorry if you hear the AC, but it is, it is a very hot day. I still have some packing to do and I'm about to actually bring Matt's computer to the new apartment. But I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I think I just want to focus on really packing and then we will pick back up tomorrow, the day of the actual move. I'll see you tomorrow for the moving vlog. <laughs>